Hi everyone, it's Holly Schultz from babygizmo.com. Now my baby must have this week isn't necessarily a must have, but a really great nice to have. It's a baby video monitor. Now, I know what you're thinking, I live in a small place, I totally don't need a video monitor, Holly. But you know what, I beg you, reconsider. Even if you live in the smallest of apartments or the gigantic castles, a video monitor, to me, is worth its weight in gold because it gives a new parent that peace of mind that I really think they need at the beginning. As a new parent, you're nervous. You're nervous about your little tiny baby in that big old crib. Are they breathing? Are they stuck against the side? You always want to, you know, check up on them. And the last thing you want is that squeaky door giving you away and possibly waking the baby when you're just trying to sneak a peek. So consider a video monitor. Plus, you know what's great about it is it's a product you can keep using even after your baby becomes a toddler and into school age. I keep the cameras and I put them in my kids' rooms so that I can always take a peek of what they're doing at bedtime. And it kind of keeps them on their toes if they think I'm watching every now and then. So if you are considering a video baby monitor, here are some features that you want to consider because these video monitors have come a long way. This one, by the way, it's Summer Infant Baby Touch and it's awesome. First of all, it has a really compact parent unit. That's what you want to look for because it's easier to carry around. It has a belt clip, another great feature to look for. The more features you get, obviously, the more expensive they're going to be, right? One of my must-have features with a video monitor is that the camera also accepts batteries somehow. Because sometimes where you want to place the camera isn't very convenient for an outlet. Also, it's a good tip to know that this cord must never be in baby's reach. It's a choking hazard if they grab it. So while you can mount many of them to the wall, just make sure that they cannot touch this cord. So if you have a, video, a camera that can also take batteries in a pinch, that's a great feature. Also get one that has a big screen so that you can see baby. Some of the more fancier features is this one actually has a pan mode and I can physically move the camera with my parent unit. If you can see the actual camera is moving so that I can pretty much move it around the entire room if I wanted. Great for toddlers and older kids. It also has a zoom in feature, another great feature to look for. That's going to zoom it in and I pretty much can see my baby breathing during the day. Now it has night vision, but it's a little grainy and not as great as, you know, your TV at home for sure, but it's a baby monitor. Um, so those are some of the features you really want to look for in a, when you're choosing a video monitor, but I'm telling you, don't discount it even if you're living in a small place because it gives you that peace of mind. You could pretty much watch your baby the entire nap if you wanted just to make sure they're doing okay. So there you go. That's my baby must have, well, kind of a nice to have, and I'm Holly Schultz from babygizmo.com.